Queen City News is your home of the Panthers. You're looking live over Bank of America Stadium right now. The Black and Blue has tapped Dave Canales to be the next head coach. The former Tampa Bay offensive coordinator is now calling the shots in Charlotte. Queen City News reporter Savannah Rudisell is live outside Bank of America Stadium with the high hopes the team has for the new coach. Good morning, Savannah. Good morning, Ann Wyatt and Jason. And the Panthers are taking a chance on Dave Canales, giving him his first head coaching job. A lot of people are very excited to see the young coach work with Bryce Young. See, his work with quarterbacks, specifically Geno Smith and Baker Mayfield, has been the catalyst for Canales' meteoric rise. Some people had dismissed the veteran quarterbacks when they were, uh, you know, a little bit uh, later in their career, but Canales helped them with some pretty impressive second wins. Geno Smith, who hadn't been a starter since 2014, was then named the league's comeback player of the year in 2022. Canales joined Tampa Bay as the offensive coordinator following the retirement of Tom Brady, and Baker Mayfield seemed to found his footing with the Bucks under him. Both Smith and Mayfield each set career-high passing yards while working with Canales with more than 4,000 yards. Canales says his stats show that he's ready for the new role. Your film is your resume. So the biggest thing I can do for any opportunities um, is to really focus on having another week like last week where we were in rhythm, the mix of the run and pass, everything coming together, you know, and that was just a, a full focus on the opponent, you know, and we got a, we got our hands full this week with the fantastic team. And again, you know, this is something I've been thinking about for a long time. And so I have some stuff prepared that I've had for a couple of years. So now he turns his attention to first round draft work, Bryce Young. Young completed less than 60% of his pass attempts this past season. So we're going to look to see Bryce Young's steps kind of change a little bit here, hopefully in this next season.